Hey guys, it's 8 o'clock right now on MLK Day. And this morning I woke up and I felt, I felt good. But I felt really, really weak. I think it's because I'm undernourished. So I didn't feel like having a smoothie this morning. So I'm having oatmeal with some buckwheat mixed in with the cereal. That sounds good. I want something that's not a smoothie, to be honest. I might have like what I have like on school days and have like a smoothie later. But I'm just not feeling a smoothie this morning. And my parents said that like, I probably sh should have something like oatmeal. It's just something very simple. So, and I agreed with that. My hair looks really bad this morning. Got that kink going on there. Just, don't worry, I'll, I'll straighten that later. Probably gonna take another shower today. Like not wash my hair, but like take a shower. Which I do anyway. I normally don't take one two days in a row. But I might my dad said I might benefit from that. Gosh, my hair is bothering me. That's better. I'm gonna add this. Add some maple syrup and maybe some raisins. Hey guys, it's currently 11.45. I just had some soup with um, butternut squash, tomatoes, potatoes, carrots, onions, celery. I realized there, like, I forgot so many things in the other vlog. Um, basil, oregano, thyme, garlic. Did I say onion already? I think I did. Vegetable broth. And now my mom starts to vacuum. Did I say barley already? I don't know. I don't even remember what I said. Yeah, I'll like put in text if I forgot anything. But I realized I forgot to say some of the things in the last time I said it. <laughs> oh. So, for breakfast I had um, raisins, maple syrup, buckwheat, and oatmeal. And then, that was really out of order. <laughs> And then I was still hungry, so like an hour later, I had just one piece of Ezekiel toast. And I was still hungry. So, th so uh, a couple hours later, some soup. My mom had some soup with me. I sprinkled a little, just a little bit of pink Himalayan salt and pepper on it. Just a little bit, just to, you know. I am just trying to like, I've been really hungry, but I'm trying to eat like really small amounts of food at a time, just in case. Because like I just had I just had this much soup, which is not that much, and uh, now I'm good. It's like digesting now, and I feel like I'm gonna just, I'm gonna be really hungry in like an hour, like really hungry in like an hour. But my food is like filling me up. And then digesting, but digesting really quickly. So that's why I'm, I'm trying to have small amounts of food at a time, because I know that if I have too much food, then it's going to make my stomach hurt. So yeah, I'm, that vacuum is really loud. So I'm really sorry about that, guys. I still have to edit yesterday's video. Something on my phone. I don't know. I can't get it out. Uh. Yeah, my mom and I were gonna watch a movie. I need to blow my nose. So I'm trying to pick. I'm trying to pick out a movie for us to watch. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm probably gonna for. I'm probably gonna make some sweet potatoes because I haven't had sweet potatoes in like three or four days. Like, also I lost around four pounds yesterday because I barely ate anything. My body's so used to like eating so much, and when I don't eat a lot, and then whatever I do eat. I throw up. I lo I went from 80, 81 to down to 77, which I haven't been since September, which is not good because I hardly ever throw up. Like this is this is very very rare for me to do this. But it was just a stomach bug that has been going around. We're well, pretty sure, which like 99% sure. So. Yeah, that is, uh, I just want to give you guys that update, and sorry that I'm like, I'm looking at myself instead of looking at the camera. Focus on the camera. 
I was also trying, I was also holding it really close to my face because it's so freaking loud. Okay, so anyway, I'm just gonna go continue with my day. I don't know. And. Hey guys, I'm gonna pick this up. It's 10.13 right now. I didn't get much footage today. I really didn't do much today. But my mom and I, we watched a movie. I snacked on some of those rice crackers. Just because I really, I, I, my stomach still felt weird today. Like I wasn't throwing up or anything, but my stomach felt weird. So I just wanted something simple. So I just had whatever of those rice crackers I had left. Snacked on those when we were watching the movie. Then I made myself a couple sweet potatoes. And by the way, I didn't eat much today really at all. But I just need to like, my stomach was getting full really fast. So I just ate until I was satisfied. But um, I really didn't eat much today, but I think I just need to gradually get back into the routine of things. Yesterday I hardly ate anything. Today I eat a lot less than I normally do. I just need to like, you know, increase my amounts of food a little bit at a time uh, but so after you watch the movie we just relaxed just chilled out didn't really do much and then I went I ate dinner I had a baked potato which was like I only had like half of it because it was it was undercooked yeah my mom didn't cook it for long enough because she was making a meatloaf too on one of the shelves and like the, the potatoes wrapped in foil on the on the other shelf but they were they had to be cooked at different temperatures and the potatoes were not cooked enough so I only had like half of that I put ketchup and basil and uh, I had some rice and beans and yeah I, you guys saw it and then I went to my music lesson, came back, turned on the, I got my video up, I uploaded my video, turned on The Bachelor, then, and, I, and during the commercial breaks I was doing some, some light exercise, I was, I was trying to take it a little bit kind of, kind of easy, I lost weight, and I just need to take it easy, and my stomach is still feeling weird, but I'm also, also working on homework. <laughs> Cause I'm waiting till now to do it. Cause I didn't know. I forgot we had it. So yeah. And now I'm watching Big Fan. Cause that was on, and I got really hooked on it for some reason. Because this was after the Bachelor. I want to finish up watching this, and then I will come back to this. Okay. So I just finished my homework, and it's 10:30, and. Uh, yeah, I didn't really vlog much today. I'm sorry about that. Ugh. I haven't really done much today. It's been kind of just like a, a chill day. I'm just trying to take it easy. Just trying to get over this. So that I'm absolutely fine tomorrow. So, yeah. And... I was going to talk about something and I forget it. I don't know, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a little bit stressed out about the fact that I have no footage for today because it's so unlike me and having less than like, even 10 minutes worth of footage, like less than that, it stresses me out. I feel like I need to add more and I feel like I just talk about stuff that is not interesting and then I just upload just to upload and I don't want to have that feeling. Being a YouTuber is a lot harder than you think if you're not one already. My parents think that it's like, why do YouTubers get money for doing this useless thing? It's, it's not like, it's not difficult at all. And I was like, and I just tried to explain them. That it's a lot more difficult than they think. But it's, yeah, because it is. If you're a YouTuber, I'm not, I don't even like consider myself really a YouTuber that, but it is hard to, especially when you're 
committed to being consistent, have consistent uploads every day. Even if it's not every day, like just being really consistent is something you really, it's really is challenging. And I think a lot of people doubt how challenging it is. <sighs> okay. And I have a lot of really long videos on my subscription box right now, and it's 10.40, so I'm obviously not going to watch any of them. And I feel like if I don't get enough footage for today, then, like, I'm going to be so stressed out and, like, not be able to sleep. Because I'll have that thought in my mind being like, oh my gosh, I didn't get enough footage for today. I have to wake up in the middle of the night to get more footage. And obviously that's not going to be fun or interesting for me or you. So... I'm still having like digestive problems like I like feel my food digesting like obviously I feel my food digesting like all the time but like like every day maybe another one like a couple hours later but like I'm feeling it slowly like gurgling inside of me like all day and it's really really annoying also I don't look as particularly skinny like I look like normal like I don't look particularly skinny but I lost like four pounds which doesn't make any sense to me I hope I didn't lose like any like anything that I actually needed in my body I doubt that but I don't know yeah like I said I just need to gradually start eating more I didn't even eat enough today or yesterday definitely not yesterday and even today I didn't eat eat as much as I should have but like I did even finish my dinner because I got really full like I I ate like half my dinner and I got really full and even and you guys saw I had it on a small plate it wasn't that much food and I got really full I don't know I just need, think I need to let my stomach adjust like even after like I had soup this morning I was full for a really long time but I felt like I was so hungry at the same time. Like, I don't I don't know. Like, my stomach felt really weird for a while. Until I decided to eat the crackers and sweet potatoes. And, eat, like, when I was eating it, I, like, felt fine. And then when I was done eating it, then my stomach started feeling weird again. I don't know. I'm really not, like, familiar with this. I have never... I haven't thrown up in a very long time before yesterday. And I've never thrown up on this diet before. I've never had any kind of like really severe like stomach virus pain on this diet before. But I don't know. I need to think I need to do some more research. Hmm, yeah. I honestly, I want to go to bed, but I don't at the same time. Ugh. All right. So... Okay, so I, I was doing some thinking about what I could talk about. Um, one, I watched the minimalism documentary. I liked it. It, it inspired me to, and now I will kind of want to get rid of some of my stuff, whether it's donating it, selling it, because we, it'd be nice to get some extra money. So I'll sell what I can. And, Donate or give away to like my neighbors or whatever. And also, uh, my dad got me a couple. He got me a new dress and a new jumper or jumpsuit. And he ordered those online. I think from I'm not sure where. I think it was Old Navy. I think. I don't know. And because I was talking to you earlier, I was like, okay, I'm so sick of wearing the same things because I, I, if you guys have followed me, you know, I have, I have issues with clothes and I mostly wear jumpsuits and rompers and dresses. I don't wear a lot of things that are around your waist, if that makes sense. Like, I don't wear a lot of pants or Leggings. I don't wear it. I don't wear leggings. I don't wear jeans. I don't even like sweatpants. Like I've worn them, and I, I just don't like them. And that's kind of why I wear one the whole time. That's why I have a sleep romper. I just wear jumpers, jumpsuits, and rompers and dresses a lot because I have issues with clothes. I want to get into it. I've had them 
pretty much my whole life. I've I've had to wear leggings and things like that before, and I absolutely hate it. I hate the feeling of them. I know they're like one of the clothes that are like, oh my gosh, every girl thinks they're like the most comfortable thing ever in the world. No, I hate leggings. I hate jeans. I, I hate sweatpants. So that's why I wear jumpers and dresses and rompers a lot. So my and I and you know when you're wearing a whole outfit in one, you can't really mix and match a lot, and you're kind of wearing the same things over and over again. And I'm just like I'm kind of sick of wearing the same things. And my dad, you know, ordered me something, you know, ordered me some new clothes, and I really appreciate that. And I have a lot of things that don't fit me that I, I'll I'll give away, because. I'm kind of growing, I, I'm probably at the peak of my growth now, like not, not in terms of like I'm stop, stop growing, but like I'm growing really rapidly, really fast right now. Ow. Ow. I have a feeling this summer will be the summer that I sprout. I mean, I hope so at least. But... So he just ordered me some new clothes and I'm excited to change it up a little bit. I have a lot of bland clothes and he ordered me some color, which is nice. Yeah, change up. He's been getting obviously more more mature clothes, which is good because I have a lot of kids' clothes that are like they fit me and they're comfortable and I like them, but they don't look very mature. So I'm excited to get to start wearing sport mature clothes. As, as you've seen that I have, I have some mature dresses and things like that. And I'm excited to get more. Also, I'm really struggling to drink this right now. My stomach is like getting really full. I'm trying to, but like the more I drink it, the more I'm like, my stomach hurts. So, yeah. yeah, I'm gonna end today's video here because I'm it's late. It's 10.50. Oh gosh, I need to go to sleep. I got to go tomorrow. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and share this video in my channel to those you think might be interested. And leave me comments down below. Comment of the day. I had one and now I forget it. Oh. What do you like to do? Like, what's your favorite? What's what's a hobby you have? Something you really enjoy doing? Obviously, I like to cook. I like to make videos. I like to watch videos. I like to clean. I don't really get to clean much because my room's always clean. But uh, I like to clean. I like to. You guys obviously know me pretty well, so you guys know what I like to do, so I don't really need to explain that. I like to collect my pets and stuff. And, yeah, like, do you, what do you think, yeah, you know what hobbies are like. Do you like to do arts and crafts? Do you like to read? Do you like to, I like to sing too, sing and act. And, yeah, do you guys like, what, what, what you, what hobbies do you guys participate in? Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed. Love you. Bye.